get your CDL, huh? Finally done made up your mind and said, I'm going to go get my CDL license. I applaud you. Yes. I applaud you. Congratulations on changing the mindset. Congratulations on taking the first step in changing your life. And now you gotta ask yourself, are you gonna really stop smoking that reefer? Are you gonna really stop smoking that reefer? In a era, in a day and age, in an era to where marijuana is about to be recreational throughout the 50s, do you really want to take on a career to where you can't smoke reef? Because we all know you smoke reef. Let's not, let's not play games. And it ain't nothing. I mean, I'm not saying nothing about it. I'm just saying, are you willing to give it up? Are you willing to give it up for yourself? Are you willing to give it up for your family? Does your family deserve it? Do you deserve to give it to your family the better quality of life and become the productive member of society that you always wanted to become? Do you owe it to them? Do they deserve it? Of course they do. And this is why I applaud you. I applaud you. Yes. And every time you open up that general knowledge book, every time you open up that air brake section, every time you couple, you uncouple, you disconnect. Every time you get that hammer and you hit that wheel instead of using your foot. And every time you really do a pre-trip inspection. Just know. All I want you to do is know is that I'm here. I'm right there. I'm with you, I'm by your side. I'm in it with you from the beginning, from the get-go. This is why you tuned in. This is why you chimed in. You wanted to see and hear what I had to say. And this is what I want to say. You're going to be the best truck driver that you can be. You giving up all your time, all your free time. You ain't home with your family. You ain't around. You better make it a goodie. You better make that move. You better do send that money all the way back home. Stay yourself out on that road day in and day out while you send money back on home. Huh? How long is that gonna last? You can't smoke reefer? You ain't got no cash? Ain't got no cash. But your family bill. See, that's no different. See, that's no different than your kids looking good. And if you don't look too, 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 too brand new, it's all right. You look good. That's no different than if you look good and your kids look bad. You look bad. You don't look good. Ain't nothing 
Ain't nothing about what you do look good. Anything you do won't go good, won't look good if you ain't making sure them kids look good. Now, I ain't saying you can't eat now. That's not what I'm saying. Because you have to make sure you good in order that, in order for you to make sure that they good. But if you not making it fair, if you not making it fit, but everything will be just fine. Everything is going to be all right. You're going to do an amazing job. You're going to be an amazing truck driver. Your career is going to flourish. This is going to be the best move of your life. Just as long as you understand that you have a responsibility of doing the right thing once you take the oath of the truck driver. You are now an essential worker, the essential worker that you always wanted to be. You here. Welcome aboard.